What's up guys? All right, so if you guys don't know this by now about us, then you're not caught up on videos. You Shame guys need on to you. go back, watch some more videos of us, check out more of our Instagram, subscribe so that you know things about us, all right? <laughs> if you do not know how much we love the water by now, let me tell you, we love the water and anything that has to do with the water. I think I did a funny Instagram post about this. Ocean number one for me, for sure. Lakes, pools, showers. I mean, we just love water and anything that has to do with water. Waterfalls, oh, it's just beautiful. So, we were super stoked when Goose Hill hit us up and asked us if we wanted to do a review on their inflatable paddle boards. We were ecstatic. We were like, heck yes, let's do this right now. So, they sent us two of their inflatable paddle boards and we came up here to Silver Lake, up American Fort Canyon, it's gorgeous. Goose Hill right now, they're actually having an anniversary sale. So if you go to their website, you can actually get 10% off right now with the code 10-A-N-N-I-V-E for anniversary. So I'll put that code in the video so you can see exactly what that is. It was a gnarly drive up here, you guys. It's literally a dirt road the entire way. And it's not just like it's a dirt road, it's like dirt and boulder road. So the whole ride we're like where we feel bad we didn't <laughs> film anything but it would have been so bad i mean we would have lost the camera because you are just holding on the car with both hands just like bum, 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 bum. it's crazy that was a little view oh, look at my hair. i think you actually legitimately <laughs> came out of your seat a few times i did and my hair like this how it just fell out from doing that it legit fell out from all of the bumps we were going on. Like I sat up from my seat and my hair tie like fell on my lap and I was like, what the? It was a wild ride. We made it up here, we're excited. It's like empty up here. I mean, the lake's yeah. not empty, but it's not crowded up here at all. To be fair, it's a pretty small reservoir, but we're excited guys. We're going to show you guys how these work. Daniel's gonna pump them up. I'm gonna watch <laughs> and supervise. <laughs> and then we're gonna get out on the water. So we'll let you know what we think. We're kind of stoked about this. There's literally two people out there on paddle boards and that's it. There's nobody up here. This reservoir is definitely a lot lower than I thought it would be. We've had so much snow and rain this year. I thought this would be way more full, but it's really pretty low, but whatever, it's not gonna stop us. We're gonna get Shell to crack open the box right now, show you guys what's inside of this. Got a bag to store it in. Thank you, thank you for the bag. Look how beautiful. So I already pumped one up here. And so far this material feels awesome. It's like super durable, super thick, super rugged feeling, which is great. I feel like these are gonna last a really long time. This took me about six or seven minutes to pump up with the supplied pump. So we're gonna go ahead and get started on this guy. Super easy, this just plugs right in there. Twist it on and then here we go. <laughs> you can see it fills before your own eyes. Six or seven minutes, we'll be back. We're making progress. It's like a Chia Pet, it's growing. You wanna swap? No, nah, you're looking too good doing that. Look at those biceps bulging. All right, we're done, this is yours, Shell. <laughs>
What's the consensus so far, Shell? Holla! Guys, these are awesome. They're super, super stable. It's like I'm riding on a fiberglass board. Like literally, I don't even realize it's inflatable. Not at all, they're hard. And I only did it to 15 PSI. You can go up to like 20 PSI on these, which will make them even harder and more stable. But I only went to 15 because I was feeling a little bit lazy. We got our drone up there behind us following around. It's doing some weird stuff every now and then. Nervous. It's making Shell nervous because it's accelerating on her. And then it's like hitting the brakes. I don't know what it's doing. But my controller is really far away on the shore. I'm out here with my sturdy old GoPro. Missed this guy a little bit. But these boards so far, amazing. We love paddle boarding. And we're kind of stoked that we got these in time for our Lake Mead trip. I think we're gonna bring them down with us to Lake Mead because one of the Madsen favorite things to do is take the boat into a cove where there's nobody around, drop the anchor, eat some lunch, and just lounge about in the water. And these paddle boards are gonna be so much fun for that so these are probably gonna come with they fold up fairly small they have nice backpacks everything fits in and so they're very portable so they're coming Alright you guys, Daniel's going back in to get the drone because I'm nervous about it. It's following us currently over the lake, which is awesome. Hopefully we got some really cool footage of that. Hopefully it was recording. Okay, this bird just stove down and grabbed a fish. That was cool. I feel like there's a lot of fish in here. I keep seeing little jumps in the water and this bird is just circling. He's hungry. We hungry. I'm hungry. Drone. Hungry bird. Bye bye, John. Say bye bye, everyone. Go land on safe, solid ground. So far, I'm digging these paddle boards. Goose Hill stand up paddle boards. I would say definitely Dan and Shell approved. I still have my clothes on. <laughs> Turns out it's a lot colder up here than we thought. It's kind of weird. Utah is kind of weird. Um, it has been so hot down in the valley, but then today has been like super cloudy all day. We haven't had a cloudy day and I don't even know how long. And today has been crazy cloudy. And then up here, it's like a little bit chilly. Like I have been getting goosebumps out here and I have my swimming suit on underneath. I came prepared with my swimming suit on, but I just haven't taken this off yet because I've just been a little bit chilly and I kind of was thinking like, oh yeah, we're gonna dive in, we're gonna have a blast, but it's a little bit too chilly for that. I'm not gonna lie, this water is freezing, like really cold, but that's okay because we are heading out to Lake Mead next weekend with Daniel's family. Again, you guys will see them. We are gonna take these paddle boards with us and we're excited because Lake Mead is not cold. It's actually very hot like borderline not even refreshing when you jump in. I don't know, but can we talk about how gorgeous this is? I mean, look at where I am right now. No wonder it's cold up here. What was I thinking? I'm literally like in the mountain. Look at that gorgeous view behind me. Give this video a thumbs up if you can see how rad this view is. Who's hill for life? <laughs> Ready to race? Yeah. Bumper boats! Ah! Get out of here, pirate! Ah! <laughs> it is muddy right here.
So you guys know I drive a little Toyota Tacoma, but I don't know what it is. There's sedans who are like riding me and then passing me. It's like, how how shaky is their ride right now? Because I'm going pretty slow to keep it kind of as minimal shaking as possible. But these like Altimas and stuff are passing me on this road. I don't get it. I don't understand. Maybe I just need to go faster. Guys, Louie is fresh and cleanly cut. He was a really long-haired little boy this morning, and now he is the cutest little short-haired pup in the world. Huh, bud? Guys, thanks for coming with us out paddleboarding. We had a blast. We love our new boards. Can't wait to take them down to Lake Mead next weekend with Daniel's yes. family. We have a lot of family photo shoots coming up this weekend because this is her parents. We're nearing the end here, or the beginning, however you want to look Aww. at it. But this weekend is their, we call it a farewell, and they kind of have a lot of friends over and say their goodbyes, all that kind of stuff before they leave on their mission. They don't leave for about three more weeks, but their farewell is this weekend. And so we're doing some big family photos. Maddie's in town because we're gonna definitely get her in the photo. Mm -hmm. And it's gonna be a ton of fun. And Shell's buddy, Jordan. You guys know Jordan. She has taken on this daunting task of taking the full Bingham family photo, all 20 of us. And we are a handful. 20 people's a handful, but 20 <clears throat> Bingham's is a handful. I don't envy her. I hope we're paying her a lot. <laughs> but that's going down this weekend, guys. It'll be a ton of fun getting together with everybody. Oh, look at Louis. Just, you're not going to be in a photo, bud. Oh, don't tell him. We're gonna go wash our feet right now because they are dirty. We love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and coming along our crazy journeys. Make sure you subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, and we will see you later. See you guys. Bye. Oh, now he's flying away. What kind of bird is that? Oh, dive too. Hey, don't come dive on me, bro. I ain't your dinner, fool. Your armpits. <laughs> My armpits smell bad, apparently. Ow! Maybe I do need a whole shower.